Hi, it's Mark Gardes here. Um, I was on UK Lock Sport Forum yesterday and we were looking at the naughty bucket, what we've got, or our naughty box with the locks that we haven't been able to manage to pick. So I thought, as my skills improving, what I'll do is I'll show you the locks from our naughty bucket and then this is hopefully the videos that are going to be coming up in 2014. Um, first of all, I've got this Squire Sal 40. I have actually picked a black one of these, which JJ8 has now got. But I actually got another one because they were so cheap. And this one's actually proven to be a bit of a pain to pick. This one was from JJ80. This is the Abus number 90 slash 50. And uh, quite hard to get a good tension on the core there to get a good feedback. I've got a Casp 12-55-0. And... Um, yeah, just no matter what tension I put on top of the keyway, bottom of the keyway, it just seems to the pins just jump straight back up as if there's nothing happening. So I don't know what I'm going to do about that one yet, but I'll think of something. I have this lockout lock that I got on eBay as well. Um, I've actually got one of these for JJ80. This was supposed to be a surprise. It was supposed to come through to him, but it didn't come here in time. But I am sending that next time. Um, a couple of security pins in there, nothing major, but haven't been able to get it open yet. I also have this American Series uh, 5200, and it's a SGG, it says on the bottom of the night, I mean, so this is from uh, Bosnian Bill. Haven't been able to get this open yet, but I have managed to get its best open, so this is hopefully coming up this year. Also onto that, I have a, looks pretty similar even with the measurements to the Squire, but this is a Casp uh, 14040. And uh, yeah, I haven't been able to get this one open yet. It does exactly the same as the last Casp. The springs just pop straight up. But hopefully get it open, open for you, and you can see that open. And I've also got this. This is a BT padlock from British Telecom. I got this on eBay, and um, it's actually made by Draper, so you wouldn't think it would be that good. But it's actually not too bad. Um, I think I've got three pins set in there. It's just the last two I'm having problems to get them set. So that one shouldn't be too far away. And last but not least, uh, with a boron shackle, it is my Yale. And that's the AGD one. Yeah, this is a big heavy lock. I haven't been able to get this open yet. But hopefully, like I say, get all this hope. And soon, and this is what's coming up for 2014. Anyway, um, stay safe and stay legal. Please subscribe, and I'd like to hear your comments.